Dr. John Deloney, Ramsey Personality, is my co-host today. Open phones at 888-825-5225. In the lobby of Ramsey Solutions, on the debt-free stage in person, Britton and Allie are with us. Hey, guys, how are you? We're Good. doing great. How are you, Dave? Better than I deserve. Where do y'all live? Uh, we're actually moving from Chapel Hill up to Minneapolis at the moment. Oh, wow. Yeah. 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 Got a trailer out in the parking lot. I love it. <laughs> well, just to do a little drive-by debt-free screen. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I like it. How much did you guys pay off? So we paid off $140,000 in four years. In wow. four years. Wow. Good Congrats. For you. And your range of income during that time? Uh, we started making around 70 and then down to about 40 for a while and then up to around 110. Wow. Okay. What do y'all do for a living? I guess I've done everything from flying drones to selling bulk fertilizer to pest control, professional yo-yo entertaining, pretty much anything you can think of. Wow. Yeah. What are you going to be doing in Minneapolis? I've actually got a job as a maintenance director. Okay. Yeah. All right. And I'm a preschool teacher and um, I work with animals as well. I've also been a barn manager. So. Cool. Yeah. Cool. You found something to do in Minneapolis already? Um, yeah. I'm currently in the job interview process. So. Wonderful. What yep. took you all to Minneapolis? What was the reason for going there? So uh, I grew up in southwestern Minnesota, went okay. to college in Minneapolis, and then uh, Alia grew up just north of Minneapolis, and we uh, so went to the same school there. So it's going home. Going home. Going yeah. home. Yep. Oh. We only uh, moved down to Chapel Hill for a year just to kind of get out of the cities for a little while and experience something new, and um, then we're going to be going back to the family farm. So. Oh, wonderful. Yep. Good for you guys. That's fun. So what kind of debt was the 140000 It was around, I want to say, 110 in student loans and then a car loan on top of that. Oh, wow. Yep. How long have you guys been married? Four on. years. Almost, yeah. oh, oh, wait. No. We're at three. Three years. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I didn't forget. <laughs> the wife is the one that forgets. <laughs> it's all right. It's okay. It's, you're kind of on the spot on the radio and everything. Yeah. It's okay. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's fine. All right. So uh, you've been married about the amount of time you've been working on this dad. Thing. Yep. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yep. And um, so tell me the story. What made you guys, as soon as you get married, you say, we're going to knock out $140,000 in debt fast? So uh, for me, you know, we both went to the same school. It was in-state, but it was not cheap. Um, mm-hmm. Kind of went through that whole pushing it off until later process, until we graduated. And then as a graduation present, my older brother gave me uh, the audiobook copy of Total Money Makeover. And I remember the note that he sent with it said, I could have bought you a wallet, I could have bought you a belt, but those things will fade away. So instead, I'm going to give you something that if you apply it, it's going to change your entire life. Mm. Wow. And he's always been one for good advice. So, you know, I sat down, listened to it, and I remember sitting on my bed in my parents' basement thinking, this is the key to get out of the mountain of mess that I've made for myself. Hmm. Yep. And he kind of dragged me along kicking and streaming at first. <laughs> mm-hmm. um, I grew up, you know, with a lot of medical debt in my family, and we... Um, just kind of, I always thought like, that's just how you live is you have debt Mm -hmm. and medical problems come up and you can't get rid of it. And, um, I always say that, (laughs) cry, um, that he saved our marriage before we even had problems because if he wouldn't have, um, got us on this path, then we would be where a lot of people are and where my family is. And, um, we have freedom because of him. So that's powerful. That's incredible, man. Yeah. I love it. We saved my marriage before we even had problems. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> and let's be honest, he may have sat down and brought it to you, but you you got along for yeah. the journey, right? Yep. yep. And I Eventually. guarantee you there was times you drug him kicking and screaming the other yep. way too. Probably. <laughs> yeah. So how has it been? You guys have been somewhat nomadic, right? You lived where everyone, where you knew everybody, and that yep. comes with its own set of challenges. Yep. And then you said, forget everybody, we're moving to the woods in the <laughs> south. And then you've had about enough of that, so now you're headed back. Yep. Um, what's it been like going back and forth and having these conversations and, and um, deciding who we're going to be when we're free from all this? Yeah, well, actually, this past year was probably the best thing that could have ever happened to us. Yeah. Um, we have always planned to kind of leave the state for a little while because we always knew that we would spend the rest of our lives there. But we um, up and moved last September and just literally packed up our whole lives and drove across the country, had breakdowns literally in Kentucky and had to leave my car there and then (laughs) drive the rest of the way. And um, but if we wouldn't have moved, we actually shaved off a year of our debt just Mm. because of the move. And we lived with nothing like we didn't even have a microwave like we had Mm -hmm. nothing and we saved and like paid off all of our debt and um it's been amazing like, but you we, also proved to yourselves what we can live without mm-hmm. yeah. and what laughter and joy looks like without all these things that we thought we had to have exactly yeah. and now yeah. you've got a new picture that is untethered to stuff and untethered to debt and it's just you two taking on the world in minnesota now yep yeah, yeah. it's been life-changing 
That's incredible. Good for you. Very powerful, y'all. Very powerful. How's it feel to be free? <laughs> <laughs> it's it, unbelievable. It's indescribable, definitely. You know, the past, I guess, since we started taking out loans eight years ago, it just started piling up. Didn't really see the end of it. Um, and then at the beginning of this year, I, I was sick and tired before, but decided I was really sick and tired now. Um, so I talked to a couple of the guys that I knew that were doing handyman work, you know, making $150,000, $200,000 a year, just crushing it. Um, and they gave me some great pieces of advice. And one of them was charge more. So uh, <laughs> I quadrupled what I was charging and I was getting calls day and night, you know, working weekends, working afternoons after work. Um, and I remember sitting down at the kitchen table, just adding up all the numbers. And she was in the kitchen and I got to that final number and I said, babe, we've got $3,000 left. And coming from where we started at 140, that it was peanuts compared yeah. to the, the mountain that we started with. Yeah. I just have a picture of my head of you at a birthday party surrounded by like screaming little kids with a yo-yo just thinking one more. <laughs> just one more birthday party. Yeah. Yeah. And That's we're happened. free, man. You're going to be throwing your yo-yos out on the highway on your drive back to Minnesota. <laughs> <laughs> what an amazing journey, you two. Congratulations. Yeah, thank thank you. you. Yeah, very well done. Hmm. Very well done. What do you tell people the key to getting out of debt is? I mean, like most people always say, it's definitely the budget. Um, but for us, there was something that, you know, you can't explain with numbers, and that was keeping God at the forefront of our relationship. Mm -hmm. um, at the beginning of this year, we kind of made a, a decision to, to strengthen our relationship with God, and we did an in-depth Bible study every single week, you know, like clockwork. And looking back on it, that's exactly the time that our debt payoff uh, shovel tripled in size. Um, mm -hmm. For us, that was no coincidence. Yeah, it's been... Um quite a journey with God on this way. We started our marriage that way. We um, started our vows like God is first. Mm -hmm. And then we always say family second and mm -hmm. work is third. Mm -hmm. And we just have always kind of trucked along that way and it strengthened our bond and our love for each other. And I feel like um, connection is one of the reasons that we made it. So if we wouldn't have pushed each other and supported each other and been there through all the tough times, because we've had some really rough times this past four years, but, um, we wouldn't be here without him and mm -hmm. yeah wow well congratulations you guys Thank very you. very proud of you you are absolute heroes mm -hmm. very well done and if you've done this by now i mean the the future is so bright you guys yeah. can do anything, cause anything. You're, as john said you're so tethered to the right kinds of things here obviously um spiritually and, and but then that sets up the financial and it sets up the careers. So mm -hmm. very, very well done. We got a copy of The Legacy Journey for you because that's the next chapter in your story. You've changed your legacy, changed everything. And a copy of The Total Money Makeover. You can give that away with a nice note to someone and Perfect. start their journey the way your brother started one with you. That's a great note from your brother. Mm -hmm. Very cool stuff. Very cool. All right. It is Britton and Alley, newly or recently of many, getting ready to be again of Minneapolis, <laughs> Minnesota. $140,000 paid off in four years making 70 to 40 to 110 count it down let's hear a debt-free scream three three two, two one we're, we're debt free, free. Ah, 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 ah. yeah that's how they roll in minneapolis <laughs> powerful very well done you had a young couple had been married five years you, it, and for those of you who are listening, you can't feel it. Inspiring two old married men in his room. Yeah. Just looking at it saying, wow. Yeah. That's what it looks like, man. Yeah. Well done, guys. That's very well done. And that guy's got a way cooler, bigger brother than my little brother does. <laughs> <laughs> I did not think to get my little brother something that profound. Good grief. I'm going to call him and ask for a do-over. Wow. Uh, too, too late. Great older brother. Uh, this is The Ramsey Show. Ramsey Show.